Now, let's get the latest on the U.S. presidential race. The much-anticipated Super Tuesday has arrived, and voters across 12 states are flocking to the polls, or have been at least, to cast their ballots. The results are coming in as we speak, but who are the big winners so far? Well, they are Republican candidate Donald Trump and Democratic candidate Hillary Clinton. Let's bring in our hand down now at the News Center for more. Dan. Mark, there were no dramatic reversals. As many had expected, Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton won big in primaries and caucuses across many of the 12 states up for grabs on this Super Tuesday. We're still waiting for results from a few more states, but we can clearly see that Trump and Clinton are dominating the race. According to CNN, Trump, still riding high from his recent wins, is expected to pick up five states. Alabama, Georgia, Massachusetts, Tennessee, and Virginia, while Clinton is set to take six states, including Arkansas, Texas, and four others. Republican candidate Ted Cruz has won Oklahoma and Texas, while Clinton's rival Bernie Sanders has taken Oklahoma and Vermont. Taking a look at the numbers in some of the states, CNN's projections at 11.40 a.m. Korea time in Georgia, Trump won nearly 42 percent of the vote and Clinton 72 percent, knocking out Sanders by big margin. In Virginia, Trump won 35 percent and Clinton nearly 65 percent. In Oklahoma, Cruz took the state with nearly 35 percent of the vote and Sanders beat Clinton with 52 percent of the vote. Clinton, speaking to supporters in Florida just about an hour ago, said America must break down barriers, stressing unity in clear opposition to Trump's hardline immigration plan. Donald Trump, speaking soon afterward, offered starkly different views of the country in his remarks. Now, Trump's Super Tuesday win is expected to intensify rising concerns among some Republicans in the party who are openly refusing to support him, with some even saying they will withdraw from the party if he becomes the nominee. Mark? 